So as the title suggests, we're going to show you the top 5 diagnostic tools for your car under £150. We'll also show you some multi-vehicle tools but these will generally come in over the £150 budget. We've personally tried and tested all of these tools, so we do believe we're in a good position to advise you of the best tools for your vehicle. Now in the description and in the pinned comment section, you'll find a link to where you can buy these tools online, and we recommend buying only through these links. This means you'll be buying from a trusted source where all tools are genuine products and you need to be aware of fake and clone units on the market, because they do exist. So let's take a look at the top 5 tools for your vehicle. So we're looking at handheld tools with integrated screens for your Nissan or Subaru vehicle. And it's quite difficult to know which diagnostic tool is best for your needs because there are a lot of different packages, different tools out on the market. So it can be quite, uh, or a little bit overwhelming in fact, to, to know and understand which tool is actually best for your vehicle and your needs. So we've got five tools set up in front of us here and we're gonna talk through each, each and every one of them in, uh, in a short bit of detail, but ultimately you will get more information by clicking the description below this video and clicking the link to all of these products where you can see more videos, information, prices, etc. Um, so we're going to start with the cheapest tool and work our way along to the most expensive tool. Uh, the cheapest tool is the iCarSoft i903 kit. This kit will basically allow you to cover the main systems in your uh, Nissan or Subaru. So the main systems being the engine, the ABS, the airbags and the transmission. So it should at least cover those four systems. It will, in some cases, depending on the vehicle, cover other systems like air conditioning, power steering, convertible top, um, central locking. It all really depends on the vehicle. In the description below this video, I'll put the email address to the guys you can contact and they will tell you whether it's gonna be suitable for your needs or not with regards to the other systems. So that's the i903, that's been a really, really good seller over the years. And if, say for example, you have a Nissan or a Subaru which only needs a, an airbag light reset, you really need look no further than one of these tools, in fact, because you don't need to maybe spend more money on a tool with more coverage, uh, vehicle coverage and system coverage. So you might be better off just simply going for this one, but I'll talk you through the rest of them in any case. So the next tool we're looking at is the iCarSoft HNM v, uh, diagnostic tool, HNM2 diagnostic tool. Uh, this tool is a little bit more advanced, it covers a few more vehicles and a few more systems. So the, um, it, obviously it also covers Subaru and uh, Nissan, but it also covers Honda, Mitsubishi and Mazda as well. And it also does a few more systems and uh, functions. So the additional functions that this cover, it'll do the oil service reset, it'll do the brake service reset, it'll do um, DPF regeneration on certain vehicles. Again, use the email address to find out if it's suitable uh, electronic throttle control, steering angle sensor calibration, and electronic park and brake. Again, though, for those additional functions, you need to check on with the email address to make sure it is going to be suitable. Um, so that's the HNM2, and then we come on to the iCarSoft JP version 2.0. This covers all Japanese manufacturers. Um, it covers everything that these tools will do, but it has a a couple of extra functions, okay? So this kit will also do injector coding and ABS brake bleeding. Now again, it all depends on the specific vehicle. It doesn't do it on all vehicles. The software is constantly being updated, so eventually all vehicles will be added. Um, it's just the work, they're always working on the software to add the functionality for all vehicles. But right now, you just need to check with the email address to double check, make sure it's gonna be suitable. But this is, the, this is one of the newest tools on the market and um, it's a really good seller. It's got excellent software and I'm sure you won't be disappointed with a tool like this. But it's really better for your needs if you wanna do injector coding or brake bleeding um, and, you, and you only wanna cover Japanese vehicles. We move on and this is a different, different ball game entirely because this is the iCarSoft CR Pro Kit. So the CR Pro Kit is my top pick. It's my recommended tool. Uh, from all of these tools and probably from all tools that exist uh, simply because it offers maximum system and vehicle coverage for the price that you actually pay for the tool. So say for example this tool does everything that these three tools will do 
but it will do it for all vehicles, not just Subaru or Nissan, not just the Japanese vehicles, but it'll also do it for all Asian manufacturers like uh, Hyundai, uh, Kia, and all the other um, Asians. It'll do the Europeans as well, so it does the likes of BMW, Mercedes, Audi, Seat, Skoda, Vauxhall, uh, you name it, all of the European manufacturers. And then of course it does the um, American manufacturers as well. So it does the likes of Chrysler, Dodge, Jeep, GMC, Chevrolet. Um, but it covers all makes and models this one. This is my, as I say, this is my recommended pick because there are tools out there that you can pay more for that will give you less functionality. That's my topic. Just my opinion, of course, you know, it's, you, you can look at the descriptions, look at the tools yourself for you, make your own mind up what's best for you and your needs, but I would go for that one. Uh, then we come on to the most expensive tool. This is the Autel MD808 kit. Uh, this kit, well, Autel are generally seen as the market leaders when it comes to diagnostic tools. So they've, they've been around a long time, so they've generally got a, an extensive uh, knowledge on the products and how to sort of develop the software in order to communicate effectively with your vehicle. But ultimately this tool will um, cover all vehicles, all systems with additional functions like service reset, electronic parking brake, DPF, steering angle sensor, throttle control. Ultimate, uh, one thing to know is this kit doesn't do um, the injector coding and it doesn't do the ABS brake bleeding, and that goes back to this kit. This kit does do that. Um, again, less money, more functions. Ultimately, the tool you decide to go for will depend on your current vehicle needs, uh, your system coverage needs, but if you are stuck on which tool to get and you want a little bit more help, then by all means use that email address in the description below this video. Those guys will help you out and help you ultimately decide which tool is best for you and your needs. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. I'll see you next time.